Hey guys, welcome back to episode 4 of NHA Play Sekiro. Let's get cracking. Right, let's see where we were. Okay. Uh, I think I was going to go to the Harata estate after beating Kyubu. I'm just going to have a quick look at the uh, memory of Kyubu, see what I get from that. Okay, just gives you a little bit of backstory on him. But attack power has now been enhanced, so that's going to help us out quite a bit. Let's just have a quick look at skills since I'm going back to Harata Estate. I'm going to pick up the Makiri counter for that um, Shinobi Hunter, because I know he's got a long spear and does a like, Makiri attack. So hopefully that will come in handy. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Estate path. Right. Ah, oh, back to this lovely place. Hopefully they don't kick mud in my face, which they can do. Like that. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> I feel like I just jinxed myself quite a bit then. I've only seen it happen like one other time and I mention it and it happens obviously it's pretty dirty right let's try a more stealthy approach to this ooh get dead okay <coughs> Oof. right that's uh, spiced up my taste palate. Oh my god. Getting cut up buttercup. Jesus. They are not letting up at all. I do appreciate anyone who's uh, watching these videos as I'm going through them. And I also appreciate the fact that I'm sure you're all aware it's going to take me about two years to complete this game because everything shits me up and I mean I am technically the best player best Sekiro player in the world but you know even the best player in the world is going to struggle pretty tough game especially when you get Status abnormalities from some little twat end with a torch. It's fine. I'll just keep face mashing through the trash mob and then cheesing the bosses. That's fine. That's going to be my tactic, I think. It'll definitely work, I'm sure. Right. Okay, since I've got the monkey axe off, arm and shinobi prosthetic, I shouldn't have a problem with these shield people anymore. Nice. Shouldn't. We'll see how it goes. Well, yeah, there we go. I don't have a problem with them, but they also don't have a problem with me. So we've got a nice relationship going on right now. Uh, oh yeah. Get shield broke, you dickhead. <clears throat> oh yeah. Spicy. <sighs> Quick, get me some milk. <clears throat> okay. That, guys, is how you perform. The excellent staff attack. Perfectly executed as well. As with everything else I do. 
insert laughter here. I like getting mauled by fire guys. It's definitely my favourite pastime. Oh, there he is, there he is. He definitely took too long to realise that I was there. I feel like Seth Rowe's giving me a handicap to help me out. Just a smidge. Why is he so angry? I know you're a shinobi hunter, and I'm a shinobi, but people call me wolf as well, so just pretend I'm a wolf, and not a shinobi, or just don't care about anything I say, and shank me up anyway. I've got fire crackers, I'll crack up your fire, or more spicily, fire up your crack. Oh my god. No. He definitely just button mashed me. Oh yeah. Okay, that's good. So somewhere else, someone has got some lovely dragon rot. Sorry, mate. I don't quite know who it is, but... Sauce. Right, let's see if I can take a slightly stealthy approach or stealthier approach because I was pretty stealthy by failing to climb a wall firstly right if I go this way I can not get munged up by basic people <clears throat> Do some ninja stuff. Day in the life. Oh, yeah. <coughs> Never mind. Oh yeah. Look how quick I'm doing everything. Monster. Let's see if I can um, perform the perfect execution again. Oh no, I missed it. I'm supposed to jump, land next to him, and then stab him in the neck. Not just dive sword forward, sword first even. Fire arrows mean nothing. Oh, shit. Does he know where I am? The mark is not red. Or the indicator. So it should be okay. He's not chasing me or anything. I can't tell if he's looking at me or not. It kind of looks like he's just walking into the wall. Uh... Oh, yeah, can you hear his footsteps? He's just, like, spam walking into the wall. <laughs> okay. Don't mind if I do. Engine of missing. Come on in, boy, let's go. Come on. Come on. Come at me. Oh. <laughs> okay. Is this not the best sword fight you've ever seen? I feel like it's... <laughs> okay, guys, this is how you cheese the game. Hey, oh, there you go. That's what you want. Oh. Okay, he's not very happy with me being cheesy. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But 
Don't let that stop you. Get back. Get straight back to the trees. There you have it, guys. Easy peasy. Oh yeah. Oh, another pro bead. I think I've actually got four now. I think. I'll have a look in a minute. More pellets. Make sure you hide. Make sure you hide. And try not to get kicked out of the pie. That'd be great. Pro tip. Oh, a new idol. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, first prayer necklace. Oh, yeah. Something about ferocity. Maximum vitality. Your man's all vitalized. Let's go. Ready for the rest of the episode. Got my little bead necklace on and everything. Ready to go. Uh, I have absolutely every idea where I'm going. Definitely. I'm not just spitballing. I'm 100% know what I'm doing. And I totally didn't just nearly fall to my death either. No chance. Okay. Oh, I'm getting oil. I like getting more oil. Can use that to spam bosses and be cheesy. Not that I'm cheesy. I only fight with Bonner. There's no cheese involved whatsoever. I definitely don't get called Night Cheddar on the rig. And if I do, that's for other reasons. Uh, what am I doing? Why did it give me an option to grapple up there if it was clearly a lie? Oh no, there's so much fire. So much fire. Stop it. Ah! <laughs> Stop being me. I feel like I'm going to spend 90% of my game flipping like that and not knowing what's going on. And then the other 90% of the game, obviously, because that's what's left. Just jumping backwards, just double jumping backwards and kicking the air, crapping my pants at the same time. That's definitely how my Sekiro experience is going to go. Because so I definitely feel like I'm getting a feel of the game. More oil, I like it. Slick that shit on. So yeah, I definitely feel like I'm getting a feel of the game. But I also have this impending fear that I barely scratch the surface and it's going to get absolutely ridiculously hard and I don't want that. I don't want it. I'm not good enough to play a challenging game. I'm not about that line. Challenging is not what I need. I need friendly, playful. Right. Like, look at this big fat geezer. Clearly, he wants to ruin my day. And I ain't about that life. Oh, yeah. Eat my fistful of ash. Finally found a use for him. Ooh. Oh, I totally ducked it like the right time. Oh yeah, I'm liking these fistfuls of ash. He's trying to score a home run on me, little 
homer. Oh! Okay. Shadow die twice. Get fucked. Stop trying to score a home run. You shit at baseball. Four rounders. For any rounders fans out there. Oh yeah. That's how you fist full of ash someone, guys. In case you were unsure of it. You just wanna grab your fistful. Get your little ash pocket. Get a fistful out of that pocket of ash. And then just like chuck it on the floor in front of you. Not in front of them, in front of you. So it does absolutely nothing. And then you saw it. That's pretty much how it goes. Uh, well, this looks friendly. I'm not sure I want to go into the bu burning buildings. Is there anywhere else I can go? Oh, oh yeah, saw it. Oh. That's a much friendlier way. Well, there's big geese down there. Go through the cemetery, there will be a path to the inner estate. Leave it to me, father. Okay, so after all of that, I've gathered that I think he wants me to find the divine heir, that little lord. And it's sorry, it he is possibly in the Arata estate somewhere. Maybe. I'm just getting a little inkling that perhaps that's what the case is. See? That. And that is how you fist full of ash. That's how you do it, guys. I might have to do a separate video series on a guy how to successfully use the fist full of ash. Because I spent so long going, hmm, I wonder if they're useful for something. There you go. Demonstrated it three times. Also demonstrated how to barbecue yourself. Voluntary barbecue. Wouldn't recommend doing it at home. But in game, go for it. If you don't mind. You can be a spin off character. You can be the wolf, aka the autonomous barbecueer. Oh, yes. Look at him. He can't deal with all the ash. 
I'm just my first falls are on point. I just I love it. I love it. Consecutive wall jump. I feel like that's not how you do it. Just X, 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 X. Or whatever your jump button is. Oh, more oil. Daddy likes. Oh yeah, Sculptor's Idol. Those little blue lights get me going. They get my happiness gears going. And they fill me up with joy. Do I sound joyful? Because I swear, I am full of joy. Obviously. Someone got very angry. Set a lot of fire. Ooh. Uh, it seems like a lot of mobs. Excuse me, uh, could your stealth work a bit better? Because I'm not failing fighting basic people, because they always fuck me up. Am I safe? No? Maybe? It doesn't seem like I am, because the music seems scary. Oh! That's how you burn yourself. Uh, why am I jumping into the fire? That's the wrong way! Oh yeah. I've definitely goofed. I jumped through the fire to get into a pit of fire. No. No. I'm just demonstrating perfect play. Not to sound big headed, but that's me applauding myself guys. To come this far. For a rogue, you are a shinobi. My duty is to protect the young lord, Lord Kuro. Lord Ishii would never forgive me should I fail. Let us fight together. Oh that's my job too, let's go. What's he doing? Oh, what have you done? You've started a scrap with a load of angry people. Oh, and I take it that's the drunkard. He seems pretty with it to me. I don't know about you guys, but when I'm drunk, I can definitely not swing a sword like that. Oh, well. Alright. Okay, now he's drinking. Is he spitting on people? Or throwing up? I can't tell. Uh, is there anything I can use? Oil. Slickery oil. Why is he so angry? Oil. Bang! Get burnt. Oh. I told you. Entire game. Double jumping backwards into angry shield people. That's what you want. That's cute. 
It's got to be Pew. I don't know, well, I don't know actually. Because it doesn't look chunky, so it could just be spit. But if someone's just spitting moves at you, I don't think that would poison you. But if they puked up all over you, then yeah, fair enough. Uh. <laughs> oh yeah. I was just about to say, I'm running dangerously low on health supplies. So, I'm not sure how this is going to go. What? No, no! This fucking kill blow was up. Why didn't it kill blow? Why didn't it kill blow? The bloody red dot kill blow was there. <laughs> right. Okay, I'm gonna definitely try a different tactic for him. Juzuo the drunk. Because there is way too many people to fight as well as him. So now I just need to demonstrate the perfect stealth game. No, notify someone for like one minute. They get angry. Cue the scary music. And then I'll just run away. I feel like it's the only appropriate thing to do. Already, that's two I won't have to deal with later. So, we'll take it. Mm. <laughs> that's one way to bait someone. Chuck a sh ceramic, sh ceramic shard right at them. Instead of by them, just chuck it at the head. Sort it. Although I'm pretty sure I've aggroed the boss as well. Yeah, I have. Okay. So I've just aggroed the whole party. That's great. Yeah, come here, shieldy. Come here. breakfast, come on, you've got me, you're an odd man, let's have it. See, he knows, he's taunting me, he knows he's big. Right, what can I use? Signature, signature item, fistfuls of ash. See? Amazing. Amazing. Chuck it at the floor. Near them. But not too near them. Because you don't want them to get blinded and be all disorientated so you can get free hits on them because that's just cheating. You just want to chuck it around you so you look all mystical. Pro strats. There you go, bang. Shramic shard, straight to the head. Stop telling everyone where I am. I chucked it at your head for a reason. I don't want to fight him. Why is the big fat guy coming for me? Fuck off, Juzuo. Maybe I can 
flunk the rear. Okay, now I'll just... Oh! Oh no, I've grabbed them all. Oh no. Just be him and an archer, which is not too bad. I can deal with that. <clears throat> oh wait, no, an archer and a shield gone. Let's see if I can deal with that shield gun because they're hard enough on their own. Maybe unless they're all just gonna run up to me and. Lumpy. Oh yes, the scary music is gone. I feel safe. Ah! Why is it back already, pissing shield guy? Why? Why you do this? I've got my signature item. Get ready to get ashed. Eh. Oh, I'm sorry for being a dirty trickster. I just meant to chuck it at my feet and be honest. Oh, honest. There is actually a reason I'm doing that though, in all seriousness. If you use the fistfuls of ash to get past the shield guys, then it means you save your blessings for your shinobi prosthetic for the boss fight. So it makes it slightly more tolerable. I'm guessing. I mean, it should be. Having more shinobi uses seems more useful. Direct correlation, definitely. Correlate, correlation does mean causation, guys. It does. Ignore your math teachers. Just the bell guy now. Gonna... The scary music's gone, so I'm just gonna assess the situation again. Let's see what's going on. Two gourds, two pellets, and a shed load of oil. Oh. Oh. It's getting slow already. That is disgusting. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Juzo. Juzo. And the bowman down. I think it's just him. Let's get that angry NPC in again. Spam, spam, spam. Yeah, I don't want to get stabbed in the back by Juzo. 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 Just mash him. Just mash him. Mash him. I feel like he hasn't got hands. I hit the sneak killing blow him, and now it's me and an NPC. He surely is going to mush him up. Oh, yeah. There we go, there we go. Oil. Oil spam. Dirty strats. Oh, yeah. The king of cheese. Promoted from a knight to a king, just like that. Cloudy, unrefined sake. Drink meant to share. I presume... I'm more afraid it's nice. I presume if I use the sake, then it would heal him as well. But you don't need healing. He's cool. He's panting. That fight was hard. On this old body. Go on ahead. Uh, 
I see. That's the same crazy old lady who gives you the bell charm to actually get to the Harata state in the first place. But anyway, uh, I'm going to call it there for episode 4. And if you enjoyed the video, leave a like and hit that subby button.